Hey guys, this is Sayyid Muhammad Amin from TechiesNet. Today I'm going to show you how to get the source code from the Android APK files. It is a very tricky process, so you need to have some multiple apps installed or multiple softwares installed on your PC. You can visit our blog cyberfreewishes.com or TechiesNet and read our article on it. You can see that how to get source code from Android APK files. Open it. As it is our recent blog, it is on the top. You can get this article later by the link I have posted on the screen. You can see the steps to attract here. You can see steps here. You need to have Dex2Jar, Java Decompiler, APK Tool, APK Install. You can get it from here. All of them download it from here. And I have already downloaded them. I will show you downloads. I have APK tool, APK tool, Dex2 jar, and GDI. I will copy this and I will paste this on my desktop so that I will place these files in a new folder. So that my process with ease. Now I will open my blog and I will read all the steps while showing you guys. Now you can see that extract all the files which I have seen on this new folder. You need to have WinRAR to extract these files. Extract here. Extract this. Extract. You can extract to the specified folder also. I am extracting all over here. You can see that all my files are now extracted. Next. Next you need to have an APK file. I have downloaded the APK files of my own website TechiesNet. I have it here. You can see that TechiesNet. I'll copy it and I'll paste it on my desktop. Yes. Now we need to change this extension from .apk to .zip. .zip so that we can extract the files from it. Yes. You can see that the zip symbol now extract all here. the files of your application will be extracted now we need to copy this file classes.dex and copy it in dex2jar folder I have successfully pasted it you can see it here dex2jar folder next we need to go to the command prompt now we need to open our folder which containing the text to jar files cd space you can simply click on here and get the address enter now we need to copy this command you can directly copy this command from our blog text to jar classes dot text copy and paste it here enter now the jar file will be created note that you need to have java installed on your computer to process this so first install java on your computer you can see that it is successful now let's go to folder and check you can see that my jar file is created Now go to JDGUI folder, JDGUI.exe, open it and click on file, open file, open the file classes dext jar which we have created just now, open, and all files will be opened, file, save all sources, save, save this all sources wherever you want, like I will save it on a desktop, 
सेफ नाउ ऑल अवर फाइल्स विल बी सेव एंड वी विल गेट द सोर्स कोड ऑफ दिस now that we have successfully extracted the source code of java files now i'll show you how to extract the xml files from apk um copy this apk tool the file create a new folder on desktop by name xml Open and copy this again. Go to copy APK tool install Windows. Copy these two files also. Paste it over here and copy the application APK. Here it is my Dagisnet APK and paste it also here and name it. the desired name i'll name it as t dot apk after completing this go to command prompt again open the folder by typing cd space where we have kept all the xml files click here we'll get the address paste it over here and enter now we need to type a command apk tool dot apk paste this command and replace the name by the name which we want for our apk like i have renamed it t dot apk now now enter now you can see that my xml files are being extracted this will take a while wait until the files are extracted a new folder will be created by name t and all your xml files will be available on that folder once you try this process it will it will be very simple for you first time it may look hard you can see that then now go to that xml folder you can find it you can see that t and all xml files android manifest now we have the java source code and the xml files combine them and you can edit them with by using android bundle or android studio or any other desired editor thanks for watching our video please subscribe to our youtube channel